Ground control to Major Tom Commencing countdown engines on Check ignition and may God's love be with you I always to the end of the room. set you guys up right here real quick so a little answering of some questions for you guys and the main one being what is your new job so a couple of you reached out already on multiple different platforms uh, YouTube Instagram Facebook stuff like that like asking me what my new job is so here it is kind of a hint spoiler alert right here but not necessarily NASA but I work for ASRC which is subcontract subcontracted to Lockheed Martin which is in works with NASA and what we're doing is we're building the Orion spacecraft so yep your boy's working on a spaceship it's pretty freaking cool honestly so lately in the news SpaceX and Boeing they've been building capsules to send astronauts up to the International Space Station that's in low earth orbit what we're doing is we're building up a capsule that's going to take us past low earth orbit, past the International Space Station um, past the moon past a lot of stuff that we've been before so <clears throat> long goal is to get to mars and that's going to be through the orion so pretty historic events i actually work over at the neil armstrong operations checkout building so we this is where they built the original apollos so very historic building itself so having the opportunity to do this is very humbling and blessing um <clears throat> and kind of by destiny this is how it happened because if you guys don't know i was a marine and uh, somehow I landed a gig in the space program, so counting my blessings every day and uh, got extremely lucky and now I'm happy to be here. So with that being said, that was a little, uh, that's, that's my new job, alright? So I even got the sticker and everything, repping NASA gear. Um, so something pretty crazy and special. So um, our nearest launch is supposed to be in 2020, it might be getting pushed to 2021. So whenever you hear SLS, Space Launch System, and Orion just know I was part of it so pretty cool um, just thought I'd fill you guys in on what I actually do now so with that being said um, <clears throat> stick around because I do have more stuff coming down for the car it's just been hectic because we have the new house getting built I'll show you guys some footage of that as well and then um, school just the whole relocation it's finally starting to settle down so I'll get more videos pushed out for you guys and uh, I actually do have something in the works right now that I'll be working on trying to film um, something small, but it's a very cool mod that you can do for your car. So, without with all further without further ado, that's all I got for you guys. If you have any other questions, um, I do want to do more Q and A type of stuff for you guys just to get more interaction throughout the videos. But um, that's all I got. It's Friday, so I'm gonna go home, and enjoy my time, spend some relaxation time with the family, and then uh, hopefully you guys do the same. So, never live your life an idol, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. All right, so actually on my way home, I ended up stopping off at the VAB. So the VAB is one of the more famous uh, buildings that you might see in regards to NASA. So it stands for a Vehicle Assembly Building. So this is where the final product is going to be. So that's where they stack up everything between the capsules, the rockets. They put everything together here. And then they head on over towards the launch pad. And that's where it launches to go into space. So I figured why not show you guys this building while I'm over here. So there it is. This building is actually 500 feet tall. So that American flag is actually the size of an NFL football field to get a, a gauge on how actually tall and big this thing is. And over here towards the sides, that's where you can kind of see what's going on. Those, that's a big garage door, so to say. But um, yeah, VAB thing is massive. Uh, this camera doesn't do it justice at all. But uh, yep, located right here on Kennedy Space Center. Pretty fun stuff. So this white thing right here, that is our launch abort system. So that's going to be our backup system. Just in case the astronauts need to abort while on the ground, that will actually launch the capsule off of the rocket and then away to safety. Pretty cool, huh? This is ground control.